When I'm in a forest, I feel like I belong to something bigger than myself. About half of each tree is carbon, which makes forests our first line of defense against climate change. During field work, I use calculations to work out the size of different tree species, so I know exactly how much carbon they hold. My name is Cristina Ponte. I use maths to study and protect our forests. Trees trap carbon when they grow. But when a fire sweeps across a forest, it gets released into the atmosphere. In our lab, we test different tree species to see how they react in bush fires or prescribed burns. As a scientist, I provide governments and local authorities with all sorts of data to guide their forest management practices. You can have all the data in the world, but on its own, it doesn't mean all that much. All these measurements and samples help me create a forest simulation model. To make it even more precise, I use the infrared vision of remote sensing satellites. This allows me to forecast the size of the forest in a couple hundred years or to simulate the effects of bush fires. For me, maths is a way of extracting the truth from the data. Being in the forest reminds me of how much I love what I do. I want my children to share my passion for exploring. Maths is a tool to understanding the little things like how trees change with the seasons. But it also helps you see the bigger picture. How all the plants live in harmony. In nature, just like in maths, there is always something hidden that wants to be discovered.